boy, this last year and a half, it's just been so hot and dry that <clears throat> I've never seen anything like it before. I've never experienced a year like this, and I've talked to people that are 80 years old that's been around a lot longer than I have says they've never experienced one like this. Millions and billions of dollars has been lost in, in taxes and revenue. I want to show you here, TJ, normally we would have had a, a bowl set right there. You can see where it came off. And you can see that all up and down that plant where we lost, lost production because of heat. And uh, normally this crop would have been this tall and you couldn't see down between the rows. And this crop was watered three times in, in June, July, and August. And uh, that's probably about half of what it really needed. We watered uh, all summer long, and normally we'll get a two or three inch rain and we can shut them off for a week or so. But we weren't able to do that this year. We've done irreparable damage because we pumped so much water out of this area. My attitude when I started farming about water, when I had a lot of water, versus my attitude now about water's changed considerably. Uh, because I don't have any more, and, and, and in my generation, we've seen this water depletion. It's just unbelievable how it's depleted. We're only going to be allowed to pump so much water, and that's it. They set a desired future condition for this area at 50-50. So what that means is that in 50 years, we're going to have 50% of the water left that we started out in 2011. We probably should have regulated this water a long time ago. There's people that's against water regulation, but we've only got so much water. If I don't need to be watered, then I don't need to be watered. Not just, not just because of me, it's because the guy down the road that's got a house well and lives in the country and maybe doesn't even farm. You know, he's got to have drinking water too, so. Um, you know, you got to look at the big picture. It's, it's pretty easy to get tunnel vision, you know, and just see, well, how does this affect me? Well, it's not just about how it affects me, it's how it affects everybody.